Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Halloween <laughs> Today, we're going to show you how to clean a fog machine. So, as you can see right here, we've got a Chevy 1800 Hurricane. Um, this was one that was used at the Wisconsin Fairgrounds, so today uh, I've cleaned probably eight of them already tonight, so I figured why not make a video for you guys. So, basically I'm just going to uh, let you guys know how, why, and what. Um, the how is how to clean it, why do we want to clean it, and then what are we going to use to clean it. So, to start off, you always want to clean a fog machine because there's deposits that get left in the pump and once it's heated up with the heater, it also can leave deposits there as well. So, the best rule is at the end of the season, clean it out. So, what I use, and this is merely my concoction uh, over my experience of many years, trying to figure out what works best. I found that this works best. So I use a 50-50 mixture of distilled water and white vinegar. So first of all we're just gonna turn this on. I've already cleaned this one once so I'm just gonna make it pump out some fog here. Alright. So as you can see here Vinegar, distilled water, and my junk. So, as you can see, we've got fog here. So, what I'm going to do, say the season's over and you want to clean it up. You heat it up. Now I've got, since I've got multiple units of the same one and my reservoirs come out, I'm going to take the fog fluid out and then I'm going to put an empty one in here like that. I'm going to take, and I don't measure this, half vinegar, and this is just a regular white vinegar you can get at the store, super cheap, and then again distilled water, and the mixture doesn't have to be 50-50, if you've got a really hard clog or something that's clogged up real good and it's not coming at all, try, try a, a, like a 75-80% mixture or all vinegar if you want to try that. Just plug that in like that. And normally when I do this I let it heat up so then I'll go through with my rag while, the, while it's heating up. My rag with some vinegar on it. And just go through and clean it real good. This sits out in a, at the haunted house all month and just collects barn dust because Wisconsin Fairgrounds are, you know, and this one was actually in the horse stables. So go through and just clean it up real good here. And you got to be careful right here at the at the outlets. I'm sure everybody knows this, but if you don't, you always want to be careful of where the exhaust fog comes out because it's usually really hot and you can burn yourself. And this is more aesthetics. This is more just to make it look pretty. All right, so with your mixture, I just wanted to go over one more thing before I show you how this cleans it out real well. Um, use your vinegar, distilled water. Distilled water is basically filtered water. It has all impurities and minerals taken out of it. So it's really going to not leave anything additional in there like a cheap fog fluid would do. Um, I always use Froggy's Fog. Um, it seems to be the best and, and it really doesn't leave many deposits behind. So. Um, I've used others. There's other ones out there, but you know the one that I use is Froggy's Fog. Froggy's Fog. Uh -huh. So once you've got it cleaned up on the exterior, um, and you've got your fluid, your 
uh, vinegar, distilled water mixture in here. You, all you're going to do is you're going to pump this until it becomes clear and just a, basically a steam. You're getting all the fog fluid out. So let's just go ahead and do that. See all the fog over here. Now you can see it started to dissipate and get a little more blue than, than a white thick fog. You'll still see fog coming out of here so you know you don't have it all out. Once you have the stream coming out and it's just basically a, a mist um, or a vapor, then you know you've got all the fog out of the system. So let's just hit it again. You still see some coming out there at the end, so we've still got a little bit longer to go. I'm just going to let this heat for a little longer. <clears throat> you can see it there. You can see very little fog, but still a little bit coming out. You want to make sure that all of it's out and there's nothing left in the system. You can barely see the steam. Um, but you still get a little bit of excess fog. So let's hit it one more time. Now you don't see anything. You get the idea. So it's probably getting pretty foggy in here, so I'm going to have to make this quick. So that's how you, you clean a fog machine. If you guys have any questions, comments, or better techniques, let me know. Again, this is just my, uh, my preference in cleaning uh, fog machines. And if you guys uh, enjoyed it, hit that like button. Make sure you guys subscribe. Halloween shit. Subscribe, Internet. Bug spot. probably won't like that, so we'll probably try another one. <clears throat> Oops. Hit the button there. <laughs>